at the NPC West Coast Classic 2017 version with Lou Ferrigno Jr. Big Lou, how's things going at this year's show, man? You're running around like a rabbit with a chicken with your head cut off. I'm making your life easier today. Man. I appreciate that. Tell us, a, you're in charge of about eight different things. What are you doing? At least. Um, I'm putting out all fires. But first of all, thank you for calling me Big Lou. No one calls me Big Lou. Always be per in perpetuity, little. You're Big Lou next to Bigger Lou. I'm Little Lou next to Bigger Lou. Okay, Bigger Lou. That, that works. Um, I'm, but I'm making the NPC West Coast Classic the best show today on the West Coast. Uh, by handling everything, making sure people are happy, making sure the competitors are, are stoked to be here, uh, making sure their show's great. Well, you were at the check-ins last night taking uh, these entries. What did we end up with, 354 bodies? 354 bodies and almost 500 crossovers, which is remarkable. Over 100 more than last year. Yep, absolutely, breaking records. Well, you're, you're a staff member at this show here in my contest, the West Coast Classic, but you're a major part of the Ferrigno legacy. Yes, sir. You're at the mic. I am at the mic. It's nice. You get to take the. You, you're, you're actually on the mic too, behind behind the stage. Yes, on yeah. the on the web stream. Uh, I'm going to be at the nationals. Oh, you are this year. Twenty fifth year. I want to get twenty five years in. Okay, nice. It's like you're golden or you're bronze, silver. Oh, this is old. You got to be okay. old to get twenty five years. <laughs> okay. But she, he does a great job emceeing the Ferrigno Legacy. Do okay. you do the Tahoe show as well? I do. I host the Tahoe show too. Similar role here, but also on stage. Yep, trying to trying to be like a young Lonnie Tiber, I think. Well, like. you can't be that because you got hair. Okay. Yeah. You got rhythm. You have glutes. You, you can't, you know, to be me, you, you have to have no muscle. None at all. Okay. <laughs> Shit, I got some work to do then. We're about 11 o'clock, I think, in the morning here. What's the rest of the day going to look like for you? Um, it's, it's cruising from here. The show's up and running. Um, everyone's happy so far, um, and then just prepping for the night show when I get to hear your booming voice um, and everyone posing on stage and seeing your lack of muscle. I mean, I'm stoked about it. You know, you know, Lou. That's my Elvis. <laughs> Lou played football in Notre Dame High School in Sherman Oaks. I don't know if you saw the field much. No, I think he was a starting what linebacker. Yeah, I was both ways. I actually, rarely saw the bench. I don't even know what the bench. I was come off stage or off off field, and they're like, "You're back on." And that starting, was yeah, starting linebacker. You went to SC. Did you play a little bit of football there? I walked on, made the squad, blew my knee out, and never really saw the field, unfortunately. So it may have been a blessing in disguise, because have you been pursuing the acting field since then, and how are things going? Had I not blown out my knee, I probably would have been on stage. Who knows? But uh, uh, the acting is great. I'm now on a show called SWAT. It's going to be on CBS primetime Thursday in November, so stay tuned for that. Uh, I play a, a, an awesome SWAT guy, and I'm going to entertain. I'm, I'm trying to inspire millions, Lonnie. Well, I saw you moving last night. Can we see a couple of those moves, some of those dance moves? Oh, something like that. You, know, you could tell this guy's loaded with talent. I, you know, I appreciate you being part of my contest. You do a great job on the stage, off the stage. Lou Ferrigno Jr., ladies and gentlemen, Lonnie T. Over, under, or out.